Okay, so I just spent like the last 20 minutes like making three copies of videos for two projects, but the problem is one wouldn't even show me the stats, which is on Polygon, and the other one had a TVL of like 6.49 Binance coin. So I'm like, like this, this, this I can't even be bothered because I do not want to be the marketing guy for these projects, all right? That's actually another strict rule that I have. Like if, so the last project I was going to look at, which was called Mashed Potatoes, was like no marketing. He's like, he literally just paid the guy on Fiverr, threw up a fork, and that was it. It's like, you know, I actually feel insulted when people put in that little effort. You know, pay for the effing marketing, all right? You know, so, so yeah. So, so that is something I haven't been noticing with the rabbit hole YouTube guy. I still like the guy. So, the pro but again, I have to like look at, you know, I don't know. There's like so many projects I can cover now, I think, that I can be pick and ch picky and choosy. So... You know, I'm going to try and, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to check the Twitter and I'm also going to check, I have to check either the Twitter or the contract, right? But usually I'm going to be, but usually what I'll want to look at is the contract TVL. If it's too low and it's clearly very low, right? There's going to be some kind of minimum. I'll have to figure out what that is. And then, you know, as long as it has some kind of minimal amount of TVL, I'll cover it. Otherwise, I'm just not going to bother, right? Because I don't want to make a FUD video. Because that's exactly what my video is going to wind up being. It's like, oh, the project is dead. It's just too low, right? So, and then, of course, how does that help you, right? You're, you're not going to invest in it, right? So, yeah. So, anyway, uh, someone's already trying to create, like, a scam copy of BNB Lebanon. I guess, believe it or not, it's a technical... Uh, it's not good that's happening. But on the one hand, the silver lining is it shows that people do seem to care about the project enough to, like, try to scam people. All right, because there's a lot of Titano scam sites and a lot of Sphere uh, scam sites, right? They just run Google ads to, like, try to steal all your crypto. And, you know, they succeed. You know, they succeed. The scammers and hackers, that is. So, anyway, uh, so this is 8% daily. It's got a tax of 5%, so it's pretty good. So this is probably just a straight-up baked beans fork. Uh, but they do have a little bit under like 55 Binance coin uh, TVO. Obviously, that's still too low for me, but it's high. En it's it's a little bit high enough for me to be willing to cover it. And it has like almost 700 views on uh, Rapid Holes YouTube. Yeah, I think I'll just call it that. So, yeah. But but as always, you know my standards are now pretty high now. So. Yeah, you know, where is there? Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, everything's a little bit jarbled right now. Okay, so two forty-three followers. So these are probably real. Uh, DAP radar. So they haven't really been tweeting much, but they do have real followers. So I mean, they put in a little bit of effort in marketing. They could really, you know, pump this uh, TVO. Funny enough, this is actually doing a lot better than the other small TVL project where the guy literally just threw up a fork and then just abandoned everything. It's like, where the hell is he? But the, but people are actually putting money into that dead so-called dead project. So I might actually be able to pull out my initial capital out. I don't know, honestly, why I put 1.5 Binance coin. That's the amount I put in to like such a small project. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. But again, you know, my lesson from Metaverse Pro days are serving me well. Don't ape into one project, right? Just do a little bit fixed amount in a bunch of different projects because you know you're going to fail uh, at some point. So it's not all lost. All is not lost either. I can still access the site. I obviously can access the contract, even though I don't really know how to manipulate it directly. All right. Just in case the website does go down, like, Right, like let's say this thing like disappeared one day. The website. Well, I can still pull out my money by, I believe, doing right contract. Yeah. Oh, okay. So I gotta go to right contract. So I got. I have to do this. And it's asking for my address. And then when I hit right. Yeah, it's also asking me for a web. Yeah. So I have to connect to BSC scan and then do it manually through here. But the website does that all for you. That's. Because, you know, when you do these buttons, what you're really doing is interacting with the contract on BSC scan. So, and of course, you have to pay the gas fee to, you know, take the action. So, 
All right, so anyway, this is a very small scale minor project. Maybe that might be for some of you. Like maybe you want to, because you're definitely going to avoid the whales, that's for sure. All right, super predators are not going to be targeting this because there's nothing really much to target. Right, in fact, they become the targets. So that's why you don't have to worry about whales too much. So, so this will be the last video for today. I learned a lot today, you know, with this slightly adjusted content format. Right, you know, because I'm I'm trying to trying to find new projects and new content sources to, you know, make videos on, right? Because, you know, you just want to pump out more and more stuff. So, uh, again, just to recap, I'm not going to put $1,000 into baked cats, right? I'm going to wait till around May 4th, and I'm going to check their marketing because they're very, like, they're very small scale, but they look pretty big. So I don't know why there's such a discrepancy. So, I don't know. I'll find, I'll just find out later when they get closer to launch. Because they literally are not launching for at least another four days and like six hours and whatever. Six minutes. So, but yeah. But yeah, I learned a lot. You can check out BNB Lemon. Um, I guess they're okay, all right? But of course, you know me, like, you know, my standards for new minor projects are much higher now. I already have, I'm already involved in way too many. I can't keep up with all these, so... Anyway, check out BNB Lemon. They're obviously doing the right thing. Like uh, they're doing, they're, they're trying their best, obviously, All right? And again, I do want to see them do a little more marketing because they ha they have a pretty good foundation now. They just have to work it. So I don't know. I guess it's up to them, right? To see what happens. All right, enjoy the shared weekend. I will see you all. I mean, I really would like to take tomorrow off, but if projects keep coming out from Showtime and Rabbit Hole, I mean. I don't know. I'll definitely see you either tomorrow or Monday for sure. I mean, I guess maybe I'll never have a day off then, I guess. <laughs> Go figure. Like, subscribe, share this video around. Thanks for watching. Thank you again to all the new people and old. Let's try to keep growing this channel, right? Yeah. Because, yeah, I'm going to get rich, but it'd be kind of nice if I can help some of you get rich too, right? So, yeah, because, I mean, why not? I mean, it may not matter because, you know, we might all die in World War Three pretty soon, but I think the probability of that is still very low. Right, because you know, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll just leave it at that. All right, see you next time. If there is a next time, I'm sure there will be.